Well, it's damaged, but I fixed worse. Come on, maybe there's someone in town who can help us. Wait a second, is that raritanium? Maybe we should upgrade our weapons first. Let's use that vendor and put this to good use. And jumped, and j seriously, what's with all the jumping? Gun Doug is dead the transmission. Who's gonna save us now? Oh, hello there. I'm glad you're here. I mean, hey, have we met before? Because I'm getting a touch of the old deja vu. Uh, I don't think so. Huh. Well, guess the old think tank could use a good plumbing. <laughs> Anywho, I've been trying to get a distress call to the Galactic Rangers ever since Drax Forces showed up. Uh, this entire region is overrun with Blargy and dropships. We need to get you out of here. Well, I can't go anywhere until I get this here infobot into the hands of Captain Quark. We were on our way to speak with him when our ship was shot down. Perhaps we could take a look. Well, sure thing. I swabbed it from one of those Blarg soldiers. Here you go. Oh, hello there. I'm Alonzo Drek, chairman of Drek Industries. Many of you may be wondering, 
Why are 300 heavily armed warbots marching ominously towards a Class G dreadship? <laughs> the answer is simple, friends. Progress. Years ago, we were driven underground by pollution that may or may not, but most definitely was caused by my father's company. Since then, we've shifted focus from robotics to planet building. Now that our project is nearing completion, we must do everything possible to stay on schedule. In this case, it means our friendly army of warbots must vanquish those who would seek to stop us. Good news? They don't know we're coming! So sit back, relax, and take comfort in the knowledge that Drek Industries is working for you! Drek Industries is not working for you. I see you're having a little transportation trouble. Why don't I meet you by your ship? We'll get you squared away and ready to fly. Geronimo! Did that guy just slide down a sewer pipe? Hmm. Well, it does look like the fastest way down. Let's give it a shot. Wanna do it again? Oh, looks like Mayor Buckwash is in trouble. We'll fix your ship in a bit, but right now he needs your help. Whoa, that is a lot of bad guys. Ooh, darn blob! Attention, citizens! You may have noticed we are in the midst of a small insignificant <laughs> We are working hard to contact the boss. But until they return our calls, it's probably best to remain in your Holding his breath, our intrepid Lombax delves the depths of uh, deepness. Or a Verilux statue. She's the youngest recruit ever to be selected for the Galactic Rangers. I doubt that's the last of them.
More of them. That must be the mayor's ship. This is a transmission for the Galactic Rangers. Please, take assistance. This is Adnob Buckwash, member of the Toad Rock Crater of Novalis. Mayor Buckwash will not last long without our help. We are happy to be of assistance. Why is Dret trying to kill you? It's my nephew, Skid McMarks. Wait, Skid McMarks, the pro hoverboarder? He sent me this infobot from Iridia, and the Blarg have been after me ever since. Here, take a look. Hey, Uncle Bobwash, Skid McMarks here. You know, your nephew. My agent and I are at the awesome grand opening of the McMarks Sports Shack here on Iridia, and boy, is this been a trip. I've gotten to meet all kinds of people. Fans, celebrities, my Gadgetron sponsors. I even got to sign autographs for these odd-looking creatures called the Blarg. <laughs> I guess they're doing something here on Iridia. Wait, hold on a second. Hydro Harvester Super Illegal Water Displacement Apparatus. Um, I don't think I was supposed to have this. Stop him! He's got the schematics! Help! Someone! Call my agent! Call my publicist! Actually, don't call either of those people. Call someone who cares about me! I don't want to die! Sounds like Skid McMarks is in trouble. We gotta get to Iridia. Agreed. But we must first repair our ship. Oh, you did it! Thanks for saving the sector, friend. Now come on back and we'll see about fixing that ship. Attention, citizens. Your mayor is safe and sound. I was rescued by a furry hero and his robot friend. I will now resume regular office hours. Can I return to day from 10 to 10? And so, Ratchet and Clank set out to fix their ship with the help of the plumber. Little did they know they would soon come so close to greatness, they'd be able to hear its mighty biceps ripple. But first, they'd have to tackle a brain-eating zombie T-Rex. Hey, wait a minute. I don't recall no brain-eating zombie T-Rex. Okay, fine. Killjoy. Well, you look about all fixed up here. Now promise me you'll get that infobot to Captain Quark. I promise. Thanks for your help. No problem. See you in the next reboot.
are these things? They appear to be amoeboids. According to my databanks, they were created by Drek Industries in order to assist the warbots. Bad guys, get ready! said the same thing. must be the way out. Ratchet and Clank were delighted to discover that their newly repaired ship now had an upgraded hyperspace navigation computer. <laughs> 